Oh my gosh, they can't attack me. <laughs> this is so cool. What's up, my dudes? How's it going today? Dak Blake here. And today, we're using a mod to make every monster friendly. That's right. It's already time for mods in Garden of Band Band 6. It's already here. It's so fast that I'm excited. So as always, my buddy and personal modder, Kokosko, worked so hard. He just like went through the files, tried to mod everything, and he added that button right here. All we have to do is just click this and boom. Everything in the game is friendly. It's kind of funny though, because it's like every every monster that hated us in the beginning of the game is kind of like, I don't know why I like you, but you're cool now. <laughs> is that how like real friendships are? It's like, hey, I don't know why I like you, but by golly, if you're not the best person I know. <laughs> oh man, I'm excited. So. Already, I have summoned Sir Datadoo from the files. It's weird because he doesn't have any AI because technically he never chases you. He's just like in cutscenes. So right now it looks like he's ready to give me a hug. I'm like, yeah, thank you. <laughs> Hold on, we gotta get wacky right away. You know, boom. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> he's perfect now, look at him. <laughs> I, I love doing these mods because it opens up so much. Throughout this episode, I wanna find all the secrets, I wanna summon all the villains, I wanna go through and just solve all the questions that we were thinking when we were playing it. But hold on, <laughs> real quick. <laughs> when your mom doesn't punish your little sibling for something she would have punished you for, it's just <laughs> He's like, what? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> when your mom actually stops at McDonald's when you ask. <laughs> oh man, these are so dumb. I feel like my humor is so terrible. Anybody who's new, I'm sorry. <laughs> Welcome all the new DAC pack followers. This is this is the humor you're gonna get. <laughs> Everybody's like, okay, you know what? I'm I'm leaving this video. <laughs> All right, enough of this. We have we have stuff to do. Let me just restart. Go to this ending here and see if it works. All right, so I just restarted the game. I'm clicking it now. Boom. Okay, so this is the naughty one that's supposed to attack. Let's just see if they uh, still do. All right, three, two. <laughs> All right, it works. Okay, now now they're just really close. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> Oh man, it's so funny. Every single time we go into a game, we do this friendly mod and it just like, it makes all of the monsters that were once like scary, they're just adorable now. Like look at this guy, look at it. <laughs> you know how in like uh, How to Train Your Dragon, they have toothless? We should call this one Toothful. <laughs> Oh, little Toothful, how you doing? Oh, who's a good boy? Oh, he's like, no. <laughs> He's like, no, I'm not. Well, you know what? We're gonna try to make him tiny. All right, and he looks funny right now, but boom. Oh, he's so adorable. Look at him. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. <laughs> Oh, this is gonna be so fun. So, um, the biggest thing that I wanted to see too was that entire like space that's so dark. What if we just fill it with light? So this is normally what we see, right? It is just so dark, everything is so scary, but we're gonna make it much better. So look at this so far. You can already see that this entire place is actually like in one building. Oh my gosh, look at this place. We can see everything. Also, Stinger Flynn is like, what are, you, what are you doing out here? Look at this. This is so cool. You know, normally all of this is just hidden. I didn't know that there was just a giant wall in the center here. We're already discovering so much. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is even like the, the lecture hall area. Everything is it, it so different in my mind when I was walking around in the dark. So we've already begun. We've already <laughs> summoned Sir Dadadu. We, we made him wide. We made the naughty ones friendly. And we brought light to the center area. Oh, you know what's weird? Nap Nap is still locked in the cage here, even though in the cutscene here, he would have already escaped. Oh man, that's so strange. I think I can even summon that cutscene again to just summon the Nap Nap, the mutant one. I think it's this. Did, oh, yep, yep, he's right there. Hello, hi mutant Nap Nap, what's up? Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey there, how's it going? Oh man. Yeah, so you can just spawn them. All right, go have some fun out there. You know what's crazy? With all the mods make everything possible. Uh, oh, wait, you know what we should do? We should take Jester. Oh, why, why did he run back? Where are they going? Excuse me, guys? Where are you? <laughs> what is going on? I am so confused. They're running away from there? Okay, I, I gotta see where this is going. Uh, oh, oh, and they're, they're just, they're running. They're doing laps. <laughs> 
Red Ball, excuse me. Just getting a workout in real quick. <laughs> okay, so I want to see what happens if we take Jester and just move him over to the, the elevator. Can we just... Could, like skip that whole cutscene. Like what if I just take him here and move him? All right it says I have the jester selected hold on Let me do it again and just move him away. We're just gonna go all the way over here and we're Just gonna place him at the elevator. We're literally changing the game <laughs> I like how he's also looking like I'm not supposed to be doing this. All right. Come on toothful. Let's go. This is so cool <laughs> I have like my new pet uh, naughty one there named toothful and now we're going to the end Although I think I might have to like move myself over over the area because I do think if I walk in that area it will uh, cause the cutscene to happen I'm not sure how that works all right so if I step right there I think it's gonna cause the cutscene so let's move myself so I'm just gonna go around the cutscene <sighs> All right, does this work? Can I even do this? All right, hey Jester, how's it going? We're just gonna, excuse me, walk on here. Oh, oh it does, it works. Okay, but there's no band band here now. Um, oh, hey guys, how's it going? Wait. <laughs> It's like an alternate ending where Jester follows us. Um, uh, 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 well, hold on, no, hold on, hold on. No, wait, Jester, how are you here? And how are you here? <laughs> hold on, can I select them real quick? Uh, I can't, oh wait, wait, no, I'm deleting them. <laughs> They're gone. No, 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 I got this, it's okay. <laughs> I'm deleting them, don't worry about this. <laughs> Wait, it says that like Ban Ban is still here. Hold on, this is what happens. Oh no, I guess it still Denied. does the ending, <laughs> but <laughs> we changed it right there. All right, so now we're taking our mod adventures to different parts of the game. So I am here in like the lecture hall area and I wanted to see if there were secrets. So behind every one of these walls, what is there so let's just add some light oh i guess for everything it's just all empty <laughs> okay but i do remember there was like a secret over here right this thing what is behind this i'm sure some people have already figured out all of the stuff but like oh there's a secret letter Ooh. It says, as per management's request, further research on case 14, which is the queen, uh, her scepter has been conducted in pursuit of observing what was previously referred to as magical powers. And then it says that the scepter doesn't exist. The official records exist only as a mural? What? Like it was never made. What does that mean? Does that mean that this scepter doesn't even exist? This was all in our imagination. Also, now that we can just delete everything, we can kind of just observe what the entire game looks like. We can just take lights and brighten up the entire area. So this is what kind of, I guess the entire game looks like. This is from the outside. This is the, wait, whoa, this is, what is this area? Oh, this is the Syringion area where we drop down into the pit here. Whoa, it's so strange because there's so many things hidden in the background. Like there's, this is random naughty one here that I think is supposed to be Oh, it's the one that like attacks you if you're in the dark for too long. It's literally just sitting here waiting for you. Oh, wow. You know what I want to really see? I want to go see my character fall down. I want to see what happens. I kind of want to restart the game and just like go to that point. All right, now that we're starting a new game, it's going to be so different. It's a much different feel when nothing is scary, right? Oh, also, hold on. He says he's scared of what's on the floor above. We can actually see that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, we are looking. Now, it's just all empty, huh? Yep, there is no other level. It's just all, all one tunnel here. I'm all leaving him to talk right here. Apparently it's like this, but this is all empty. All right, so I'm here uh, in the area with my character and a rogue's character where we're about to battle. Look at me, why do I look so happy yet? I'm so like mad. <laughs> You know what it is? Is that I'm finally happy to be separated. I'm like, you know what? I am an individual person now. I'm funny. Your jokes are trash. <laughs> and he's like, what is going on right now? So I added a light down there. I want to see what happens. So I think I, Come on, okay, man. so here it is. Oh yeah. So like, this is the floor right now. Wait, Your jokes I could also change this cutscene too, huh? Hold You'll on. Have one leg. Oh, whoa. Everybody will think you're yeah. the joke when you're hopping around like a bunny. I'm like, no. We must get back <laughs> together to prevent that. <laughs> it's so strange oh, hearing this and hearing my own voice. Let me think about it for a second. Okay, okay, let's see. Never! Oh, that is such a good hit too. <gasps> they fall further? Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, wait. How do I find them? Do they just fall forever? Okay. 
So I've been, I spent the last like three minutes trying to figure out how to select these characters. I can't, they're doomed. They're doomed to their own fate. The only thing I could do is I made it really bright. I wanna see what happens when they fall, how far they actually fall. All right, so here we are. I'm thinking about it for a second and then boom. Okay, let's follow them. Where are they going? Where are they going? I think, oh, they disappear. Oh, they're right here. So there's me. <laughs> Oh, there's a Roga. That's so cool. They kind of just freeze in time. I wonder if these characters will ever come back, you know? Well, it's time to break the game though. So we could just add in the naughty ones and just have an army of them, you know? Feels like we need to do that at this point. You gotta break the game, you know? What's a Dak Blake video without it crashing? <laughs> so we have now summoned so many of them. And because we have the friendly mode, they can't attack. And we also summoned Sir Dada too, which he kind of looks stressed out right now. He's like, ah! Children, please be calm, collected. Where are you guys going? They're all surrounding him too. They're like, Dad, Dad, I want, I want food. So this is only the beginning of our mod adventure. I mean, we always start with like friendly mod. I want to do like a tiny mod where I make literally everything tiny. <laughs> like every single cutscene. Can you imagine? Like Sir Daddy Do jumping in and he's like, it's the size of an ant and he's trying to attack Ban Man. Ah, oh, man, there's so much we can do. You know what we should also do and that we haven't done is like a baby Jumbo Josh mod. You guys were saying make a baby version of everybody, but I want to, I want to do everything. So you know what? I think this is it for today. I'm going to leave it here, but make sure to subscribe and join the DAC pack if you're new. Try to subscribe with the back of your head. I feel like that's kind of the hardest thing because you can't see what you're doing. But then, hey, you'll become part of the DAC pack as we go towards 3 million subscribers. I thank God every day I'm able to do things like this and I want to do some more to make you smile every single day. I'll see you in the next episode. Probably coming up right now. I'll see you there. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, peace out, my dudes.